have a funny TV here. It starts and then keeps on restarting here. It says smart TV. The lights up. No problem. You hear the sound. And then it keeps on going. It's a cycle. I wonder what's going on. You can remove the Clippus TV by, I just used a butter knife and then just went around with a marker to unclip it all. Alright. Here's all the, the goodies inside. So I know it's not a backlight issue because I disconnected the power here and the lights are turning on. You can see the glowing of the lights there. So it could be a motherboard issue or a bad panel. One of those two. So what I did now is to see if it's the panel, because this doesn't have a TCOM board, all the processing is done by the main CPU is, you follow this ribbon and you have these connectors here, um, one on the left of the panel and you have the other one on the right. On this disconnected one side, that means that half of the screen is going to be black but after doing that, it's not doing the cycle anymore. That means you, so I'll show you here. You see, you'll have half the screen black because there's gonna there's a problem on this half. So if it doesn't work, you can do the other cable and this will be the other black uh, half of the screen. And it's not restarting. That means that your main board is good Mm, your power supply is good, your backlights are good. It means that there's a short, basically, you have a bad LCD panel. And you can actually fix it with just a little bit of tape. Because basically, one of the lines, one of the lines are bad that go to the panel because there's hundreds of little lines here and we can tape, we can put a little bit of scotch tape on a couple of these connectors to find out where the bad part of the panel is. And then after we put a little bit of scotch tape here, we'll reconnect it and see if it keeps on turning on and off. And then that's the fix. I've, I've seen it mostly, it's on the right hand side I mean the left hand side of the TV, like, but it'll be the left back, right back here. So let's get a little bit of tape and tape that up. And you want to cut just a small little strip. Now I don't know 100% where to tape, but I'm going to guess right here. There's this little thing. And we may have taped over too many, but we're just trying to find out approximately where. So right now, and then we're going to reattach the cable. Just turn off the TV first. Okay. All right, let's turn it on. So the back light's on. See if it restarts. You can hear it turning on.
let's pull it up. Sometimes Emmy has some lines. It looks pretty good. Kind of glitches now and then. But it's not turning off, so we know that that is the location. But it does do a little flickering. So I'm going to make that a little bit smaller. But it's not turning off, so that's good. That means we're close. We just have to play around. I think I got the right location this time. It's not turning off and there's no flickering on the screen or whatever you can see there. So I did a little re reset too on the TV. Working like a charm now.